Hello and welcome to the session. In this session we discuss the following question which says the following table shows the percentages of buyers of four different brands of chocolates. Represent the above data by a pie chart. First let's recall First let us recall the formula to find out the central angle for a component this is equal to the value given in percentage of the component upon 100 this whole multiplied by 360 degrees. This is the key idea for this question. First let us study the given table. In this table we have that for the brand A the percentage of buyers is 20%. For brand B the percentage of buyers is 40%. For brand C the percentage of buyers is 30%. And for brand D, the percentage of buyers is 10%. Now let's move on to the solution. First we will make a table for the calculation of central angles. So we have made this table for the calculation of central angles in which we have brand, percentage of buyers and the central angle. Now for the brand A, as you know that the percentage of buyers is 20%. So we write here 20%. Now to find out the central angle, look at this formula for the central angle for a component given in the key idea. In this we have the value of the component given in percentage upon 100 and this whole into 360 degrees. So the central angle for the brand A would be given by 20 upon 100 into 360 degrees. Now this 0 and this 0 gets cancelled. This 0 and this 0 gets cancelled. 2 into 36 and this would be equal to 72 degrees. Now for the brand B, the percentage of buyers is 40% as given in the table. So we write here 40%. Now using the above formula given in the key idea, we calculate the central angle and this would be given by 40 upon 100 into 360 degrees. Now 0 and 0 cancels, 0 and 0 cancels, 4 into 36, this would be equal to 144 degrees. Now for the brand C, the percentage of buyers is 30%, so we write here. 30% and using the formula given in the key idea we find the central angle given by 30 upon 100 into 360 degrees 0 0 cancels 0 0 cancels 3 into 36 is equal to 108 degrees for the brand D the percentage of buyers given in the table is 10% so we write here 10% and the central angle is given by 10 upon 100 into 360 degrees. Now 0 and 0 cancels, 0 and 0 cancels, 1 into 36 is equal to 36 degrees. Now we can easily draw a pie chart. First we draw a circle of any convenient radius. So we have drawn this circle of any radius. This is the center of the circle. Then we draw horizontal radius of the circle. So we have drawn the horizontal radius of the circle. Now starting with the horizontal radius, we form the sectors with central angles of measures 72 degrees, 144 degrees, 108 degrees and 36 degrees respectively. As you can see we have formed the sectors with central angles. 72 degrees, 
144 degrees, 108 degrees and 36 degrees respectively. This sector with 72 degrees as the central angle is for the brand A. With central angle as the 144 degrees is for the brand B. With central angle as 108 degrees is for brand C. And with central angle as 36 degrees is for brand D. So this is the required pie chart. This completes the session. Hope you have understood the solution for this question.